Welcome to another episode of a Dine Mall series. This is Urbex, A Peek Inside. Today we're in the Milwaukee area exploring a COVID-19 dead mall. In contrast to an enclosed mall, instead of empty hallways and empty shops, we have empty streets, empty storefronts, and empty sidewalks. Many people have gotten sick, many people have died, and many lives have been ruined from all different levels. A stunning report just out, it shows a record shattering 6.6 .6 million Americans filed for unemployment benefits last week. That is double last week's record report. It's hard to even wrap your head around these gigantic numbers. The most optimistic takeaway is that Americans are doing what they've been told. Businesses are shuttered, people are staying indoors. This pandemic has brought many unknowns. How long will businesses have to stay closed? How long will people have to stay in their homes? And whether or not businesses will survive after this is all finished. Around the world, economies are crumbling. Since the coronavirus outbreak, the price of every vital commodity has fallen thinking about commodities, it's always a, a bit of a balance of supply and demand, yeah? Um, so, so I think that demand story, yes, is softening, and we can talk maybe about the, uh, the virus impacts as well. The stay-at-home orders across the country and around the world has affected people's well-being. Psychologists and suicide hotlines have seen an increase in calls over the last three weeks.
would like to thank everyone for watching this special episode of a Dying Mall series. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comments below. And please stay safe, and let's flatten this curve. Thanks, guys.